Hey guys, we're trying this again. Vader Immortal, episode 3. I've already done 1 and 2. I started episode 3 a few minutes ago and it started disconnecting and reconnecting me. So, <clears throat> anyway, we're back. We're back. Um, so, let's uh, try to get through this. This is the last episode. And uh, as such... Um, <clears throat> Turn the audio down. Oh, it's already down. Okay, good. Go for comfort. Standard settings. Oops. Uh, settings. Seated on. Back. I just want to make sure that, that didn't change anything. Standard settings. There we go. Back. Back. Start. All right. Here we go. Is Admiral Carius. Surrender control of your ship. Lucifer's a mining planet. Why are the Imperials taking us there? Vader seeks the bright star. He must not succeed. Corvax? That creepy guy said you were a descendant of Lady Corvax. She stole the bright star, believing it would be so her husband to life. It reduced our world to the wasteland you see now. I can't see anything. Needs to an end. Hurry the now fuck up. You have outlived your usefulness. A word of advice. Do not anger Vader. May the sleeper guide your spirit along the river of stars. Vader won't waste any time activating the Eon engine. When he does, he will destroy what little life still clings to our planet. Only you can face Vader. Our only hope is to attack his castle. Wait, 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 wait. You want us to take on his entire garrison? We need an army for that. You have an army. As Lady Kovac's descendant, you can command the Horde in battle. Even now, they are with you in the necropolis above. Uh, unless you can magic us up some wings. Can't really see how we're gonna make it all the way back to Vader's castle. Perhaps we can restore that ancient air skiff. What air skiff, bug eyes? Ah, oh, that is right. Unfortunately, we lack the necessary tools. Step aside, crazy pants. If I can fix a hyperdrive, I'm sure I can repair this. Whatever it is. She's a Swiss Army knife. Follow me. Go on. We got this. Well, I got this. Anyway.
This platform is designed to lift us to the necropolis. However, it is not functioning. Its source of power is energy crystals. These can only be set in place by one of Kovac's blood. Mm. Don't worry, I got you. Let's throw that one. Oh, up there. Throw this one right. No, back. No. Up. No. Alright. Up, up, up. Okay, you're pissing me off right now. There we go. Pull that one. there. Actually, let me just go over here for a second. And look at these things. Quickly. We must go to the necropolis. Okay, fine. But they're fixing the ship in the other part there. Shouldn't we go get them? Vader will take the Bright Star to his chambers and activate the Eon engine. Yeah. But if we hurry, we may yet stop him. Okay, good. I know you did not choose this path, but our future depends on you. You shouldn't rely on other people for you. My future. people will do what we can, and I have someone another to aid us in our struggle. Okay. Is there anyone here watching this, by the way? I haven't got any messages, so... The Necropolis. We are here. Good. The Marching Horde awaits us. Not a band account. Yes? Okay, good. So there are people here watching. There they are. Good. Lady Kovac's matching horde is legion. I guess that's the only place I can go. Your light sword can command I them, can't see them. And there is one who still knows how. Not a band account. If I can't, Lord if you don't see it on screen, I can't Thank see you it. For heeding my call. I never see super chats during VR, ever. Veda now possesses the Bright Star. How will you stop him from activating the Eon Engine? Perhaps we can destroy it. And destroy the Bright Star along with it. If we shatter the Bright Star, the life current will be free to flow through Mustafa. But first... We need the Marching Horde. With the Horde at our side, my tribesmen can engage Veda's troops. In order to awaken the Horde, you must make the signals of authority with your light sword. Okay, it's called a lightsaber. <coughs> but, alright, so. Use the light 
sword to fuck him up this thing. By the way. Stroke yeah. upwards, left to right, then straight downwards. Oh. The hod is responding. This is cool. Now, a second gesture. This time, a three-pointed shape. A tribute to the three favors. That's triangle, dude. Magnificent. Keep going. One final series of gestures. Sweep your light sword upwards to finish in the position of command. It is done. They now recognize you as their master. Only you have the power to stop Vader. Your strength will be tested, but we will help where we can. The chamber opens. Stormtrooper! Use your light sword. Yes. Direct the horde against them. Sort of omens. Give me sight. Beyond sight. is under your captain's command. But if we are to stop Vader, you must now transfer that command to me. I will lead them in our assault on the garrison. Touch your light sword to my staff. I can't get close enough to you. Captain, we can't cram that whole blanket army onto this gift. Better do as she says. Okay, I, I don't know what you want me to do. Transfer the authority to me by touching your life sword to the crystal on your staff. It won't let me. Like, it won't let me, lady. Hold on. Can I get closer to you? No. to have our own horde, but while it lasted. Wanek will take you to Vida's castle. I will follow with the horde. How about this time I'm the pilot of this rest bucket? Hmm? My servos can't take any more of your pilot. Why am I here? Whatever it is that you're calling it.
Ancient lava flows formed a network of conduits. My tribesmen mapped them out centuries ago. Without my guidance, a soul could be lost down here forever. Presuming any soul in their right mind would want to come down here. Hey, pull that thing over. What the fuck is going <clears throat> on? Power down your vehicle and surrender your weapon. <laughs> Attack! Could get on. <laughs> Glitching hardcore. We need reinforcement. Can't you keep the piece of junk go any faster? Drop your weapon. Well, I'm gonna die, apparently. I'm stuck on this guy. You'll have to deal with the troopers. We can't outrun them. You gotta get by him. Can you use the force? I can't do anything. He's blacking out on me. Okay, I can't do anything. Jesus Christ. It is Vader Immortal. There we go. Why can't I fire? Pulling back! There they are, stop them! I can't. I can't pull the trigger, apparently. What the hell? About your eye goggles. So, what do you have? Poor eyesight? They are for protection and the style. Oh, right. Okay then. Daylight or lava light? We're at the surface. Indeed. What's going on at the top of Vader's castle? We must hurry. All right. I'd hope the hangar would be open. You'll have to find a way to override the controls to let the horde inside. Okay, Wanna, you get your ride back. Just don't try any fancy flying until we're off of this thing. Okay, this is really pissing me off because nothing's working right now. Good luck, my friends. The fate of the galaxy rests in your hands. No pressure, bug eyes. Thanks, man. But seriously, Mom, be careful. 
didn't I just tell them about fancy flying? Oh, if Wannick doesn't crash that thing, I'll be amazed. All right, let's go. Can you reach that lever inside? Oh, that works. Why am I so close to the ground? I think this game's kind of glitchy. Heads, of course. Oh, but once we get the hangar open, our droids ought to distract them. Coast is clear, Captain. Let's get out. Oh, okay. Ship! Oh, windfall! We'll be back for you later, my beauty. We've got to find a way to get our army into the hangar. See if you can activate that control panel right in front of you. Let's launch tight fighters. Great idea! The hangar door should open to let the TIE Fighter out. See if you can get it to launch. Chance now. That'll keep the bucket heads busy. All right. Come on, we should get going to the elevator. Come on, let's head to the elevator while they're busy. <laughs> I warned Lord Vader you couldn't be trusted. <laughs> <laughs> that let's go you lead the way and be ready for trouble Wow, 
Yeah. Hitting me. Look out! Drop your weapon. I'm really bad at this. So many bucket heads. Captain, watch it. Come on. Detonators. Don't mind if I do. I never have enough of these babies. Right, so I like explosives. Awesome. The Mustafarians won't stand a chance against that. It's about to get real busy down here. I can't go down. Aha. Uh -huh. Problem is now I can't move. Let me put this away. Come on, let's move. Okay, hold your fucking horses. Thing. Uh. 
That's frustrating. Guys, we gotta find a way to take that thing out. Ah. Perfect. Nailed them. Okay. Good. Right. Let's keep going. Yeah. God damn, this is... Move. Yeah. I gotta replay this again when my fucking VR is working properly. My friends, fortune favors you both. Fortune had nothing to do with it, lady. That was all skill. Now, you and I must stop Vida. Bug guys, come on, you're with me. We'll get the windfall and keep the Imperials off your back. Call me superstitious, but I'm not going to wish you any more luck, Captain. Just hope I see you on the other side. Okay. Blessings to you both. Follow me. on the actions of an individual. Remember, yes. the bright star represents the life energies of an entire world, and life longs to be free. If the moment presents itself, do what you must to destroy the Aeon Engine. Vader has activated it. Okay. Draining my life force. You must stop him before he drains the vitality of every being on this planet. Oh, I have taken goody. you as far as I can. 
Emperor. But you must finish this alone. Reach inside yourself. Find strength. And remember, fate chose you for a reason. Goody. All right, well. Loki. He found his pain could be harnessed by the dark side. Anakin, all I want is your love. Padme, you will be mine again. If the energies of this world are not enough, there are countless others. You! Me. So, you survived the caverns. No matter, you've arrived too late. Can you feel it? Your own life force is ebbing away. Where your ancestor failed, I will succeed. I don't think so. Time for one final lesson. Okay. Do it. Really? Is that all you've learned? On the engine, do you see? Your ancestor's destiny is fulfilled. But then. See how much of your training you recall. Oh shit. I did that one. Okay. This is bullshit. Engine recognizes you. Your blood connects you to its power. Enough. She was almost within reach. Now she is lost to me again. Because of you! Oh shit. Ah! Now, die. This is the moment. Look, the Bright Star is vulnerable. Vader thinks his willpower can achieve what Lady Corvax could not. Instead, he will tear this world apart trying to resurrect shadows. The Eon Engine must be destroyed. Use the Force. Reach out with your mind and summon the Light Sword. Plunge the Light Sword into the Bright Star. My gratitude. You have freed me from the prison of time. And in doing so, righted our wrongs. The priestess was right. The energy from the bright star now flows through Mustafar. 
slowly, our world will begin to heal. Cool. I'm glad I could help. Is that the end? Thank God that's not the end. Gotta get the hell out of here. I hope my droid's okay. Haha. -ha. Well, look who's awake. The whole family's back together again. Back on the windfall. As it should be. Yeah. Okay, we are all set to clear the atmosphere. Finally, we can get off of this hellscape. Hey, let me take a look at that saber, would you? Something familiar about it. The design looks kind of like the totem Violet gave us. He said it dated back to Lady Corvax's time. Put it in, it's a caber crystal. Got it! By the Maker! A star chart! <clears throat> Wherever that is, it's way beyond the Outer Rim. It almost looks like a treasure map. Can we check it out? Yeah. Let's do it. Can I pick that up? I want to hold it again. It's a pee. Okay, well, let's do it. Let's go. Yes! We're almost clear of Mustafar. Get ready to jump to hyperspace. Punch it, Captain. We've got a treasure to find. Yeah, that's a good way to end it. I like that. I hope there's more of that at some point. Well, there you go, guys. That was a clusterfuck, that last episode, because... <clears throat> My VR wasn't calibrated properly or something. It was not working like it should have, which was stupid. So, uh, yeah. David S. Goyer. Nice, nice. Um, recenter. And yes, there's no music because I chose not to do music because it's going to get flagged the quickest. Anyway, guys, that is it. It seems like it keeps connecting and disconnecting now again. So that sucks. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this and I'll uh, see you guys next time. Um, I don't know if I can skip this. Probably not. No. Um, and yeah, anyway, as I was saying before, in the other ones, I have a bunch of VR stuff that I want to try out with you guys. So, um, yeah, thank you, Charles. <clears throat> um, so there will be more VR experiences. And like I said, I've done all three parts of this now. I need to go back and replay it, though, and play it better. Um, so I don't know if I'll 
stream those necessarily. Um, but <clears throat> anyway, um, I'd like to thank you guys for joining me and check back every time I do a live uh, playthrough. Um, it'll be something cool and interesting and hopefully you guys will really enjoy it. So anyway guys, that's it for now. Thank you very much. Have a good night and I'll talk to you later.